Alright, hey there guys, what's going on? This is going to be a trophy or achievement guide for They See Me Bag and They Hate. Now this is one of the most difficult uh, trophies for this game. And that alongside the guessing game achievement. I have another guide on that if you guys want to go check that out. I do a pretty good job, I think. Not bragging on myself or anything, but that will definitely help you all get in that trophy or achievement. In this one, the same, uh, in the same aspect, it's a luck-based um, trophy. So you pretty much have to run the same mission over and over and over and over and over and over and over again. And I'm sure many of you guys are here for that reason because you don't feel like you're getting what you need out of this and you're spending so much time on this you don't understand why why is it not working or i i sat there and thought why did they put this trophy in the game i was like this is the most ridiculous thing i'm showing you guys right now that i do have this game platinum unfortunately i wasn't uh last night is actually when i got the they see me bag and they hate and i'm going to show you guys exactly how i got it and what i did to get it because uh, I see so much stuff out there online of you need to run rats, you need to run it on normal, blah, blah, blah. Um, and you have to make six bags, throw it in the van, blow up the, uh, blow up the lab, and that spawns the overpass escape. And then blah, blah, blah. It's just ridiculous. I'm like, this is, it never worked for me. I tried it. I tr can't even begin to count how many times I tried that uh, way and it took way too long and I'm going to show you guys a quicker way of doing it so you see I got guessing game back in February and um, you see uh, wherever they see me begging they hate and I got it uh, this morning last morning yeah yesterday morning and then I got the you're going to see I got the platinum at the same time so I got it I got it exactly at the same time and I'm going to show you guys what I did so what you're going to want to uh, first off what you want if you want to do this quicker, just just try to like get this done. If you guys were in the same boat as me, and you, this is the only uh, trophy you had left, uh, have the uh, this one right here, transporter and the enforcer. Uh, you move 50% faster when carrying bags, and you can throw bags 50% further. Having the saw is really important if you can do that. And the technician, uh, your drilling efficiency is increased. I obviously don't have those, unfortunately, so I'm gonna, I'm off by that because you're gonna be drilling through van, uh, through vans, and it's gonna help you out a lot. So what are you gonna do? I ran it crime net offline. Now I'm, I'm sure you could probably do it crime net, uh, play with people, do it quicker. I'm gonna show you exactly what I did, and I took notes after I did it just so I, would, I could uh, tell you guys what I did. So. Um, what I, this is a DLC mission. If you guys don't have it, sorry. <laughs> Go ahead and move on. Three minutes into the video. Sorry, I wasted three minutes of your life not telling you it's a DLC mission. So, uh, Transport Harbor. You're going to run this. I did it with Team AI, just to help me out a little bit. Go ahead and buy it. Um, uh, and uh, I'm going to... I'm going to tell you guys what happened the uh, first time, because I... I sat here and I played it about five times. Nothing was really working. And then uh, I tried something that I saw online and it gave me perfect results. And I was like, okay, maybe that was all I needed. Because I ran it. I ran it a few times and I did get overpass escape. And I'm pretty sure you can only get overpass escape and, uh, and garage escape. And when I saw that escape pop up, and I was like, oh man, please, I hope it's better be garage escape. All right, so I'll let you guys know exactly what I did. I didn't buy any assets. Um, if you have these saw, that's going to help you out a lot. I ran with like whatever. If you want to go really heavy, I wouldn't I wouldn't recommend that just because uh, you're going to be moving bags of money. It's going to slow you down more. I'm going to roll with, let's see over there. I'll roll with that just to give me a little bit more armor. Help me out. Um, go ahead and start it up. Whenever you start it up, it's going to tell you how many trucks there are. If it's one or two trucks, restart the mission. I'll show you how to do that. Um, if it's three or four, you're good. You're fine. All right, three trucks. We're good. It's perfectly fine. I'm going to show you guys exactly where you need to go. Right when you spawn into this mission, run out of the uh, run out of this crate and go to the right. There are going to be civilians over here. Shoot all of them. Uh, the more... Oh, don't get away. Don't get away. There's two. The more there are, the better. This is going to help you out even more. There's three. I need like one more. Oh, there we go. There. We go. Yes. All right. Four is good. If you have four, uh, 
I don't, I don't even know if five can spawn. I haven't had five. That was the problem I was having. I was never shooting the civilians, and I think um, whenever I did that, I got garage escape, which is I was like, well, well maybe that's all I needed. Maybe the the uh, rumors and speculation about all this stuff actually worked for it because I got garage escape. So you shoot the shoot the four civilians. Go ahead and throw on the drills. This is where it's going to help. Uh, getting through. I mean, if you have shape charges, you can put them on, but I I think you only spawn like six shape charges, so it's not really gonna it's not gonna do you a whole lot of good. So it's going to hold out. You're gonna hold out here for a little bit. Um, and actually, I'm gonna tell you guys something else that happened to me, and it, you, uh, just believe me here, because I don't have any uh, I don't have any record to prove or anything, but just believe me when I tell you this that. Uh, I did garage escape, or I, I I played this mission harbor. Uh, when I when I got the trophy, the time before, I, I did harbor and I did the mission, and uh, the boat spawned. I had eight bags out. The boat spawned, and there's so much speculation online telling you that if you get the boat to spawn, go ahead and restart because that's not going to give you garage escape. And I thought, okay, it makes sense because a boat. How is it gonna? How is it gonna get to a garage? Like that makes no sense. And I was like, okay, it makes sense. But at the same time, I was like, I'm gonna give it a shot. I'm gonna go ahead and throw in some bags and see if I get garage escape. Like, why not? Just go and give it a shot. I threw in seven bags, and I left the eighth one. I was like, it doesn't even matter to have the eighth one. I just completely, I was so oblivious, and I escaped um, with seven bags, and I got garage escape from the boat. It is, it is possible. It happened to me, I promise, whoever, if you guys want to believe me. Um, I got it from it, and I had seven bags. And the look on my face, I wish every single one of you guys could see it, because I've been trying for this, I mean, I've been trying for this trophy for however many months, back from, like, February when I got the guessing game one, which that took me forever. So, I mean, it, it, it you can do it with the boat to spawn. You'll see the van or a boat will spawn, and, um... Because I got eight bags, the boat spawned. Or I got seven, sorry, seven. So I would have been so happy. But immediately after that, immediately after I tried that, I, I was like, okay, I'm going to try it like one more time. I'm tired, it's late. Let's go ahead and do this. And I killed four civilians, got eight bags. I escaped in the van. I got garage escape again. And I was like, oh my lord, thank you for this. That I'm platinum this game. I'm done with it. I can move on to the... Uh, remastered version whenever it comes out in about a week so I'm sorry this is gonna be a little oh, so, this is live too so I'm kind of uh, not prepared on <laughs> what, I'm, what I'm talking about and as well I left uh, whenever you escape with eight bags throw the eight bags into the van and escape during an assault I, I'm gonna go and say this again. I don't know if it if it helps or blah blah blah, but um, go ahead and escape during uh, an assault from the police just to ensure that you're gonna get it. Who knows? But it may as you I mean it helps. I guess it's not that big of a deal to wait out like 30 more seconds for the for the assault to spawn. And it's late tonight as well. Whenever I record this, it's like 1:49 in the morning. So um, so my voice is kind of getting a little. It's kind of going out. So, I mean, this is this is just an example of exactly what you are going to do whenever you do this. If I get Garage Escape or not, um, that doesn't matter. I'll go ahead and just, just end it. And if you guys want to go ahead, I mean, you didn't have to watch up until this point. This is just showing you what you need to do. So, I mean, if you guys want to go ahead and end it, there's, okay, one van opened up. I'm gonna, this is where the saw comes in, uh, comes in play because if you didn't have the saw you would have to lock pick each one of these and that takes forever but if I pull out my saw I can unfortunately I have uh, you can get uh, uh, b gold to spawn you can get uh, cash bags to spawn luckily I got jewelry and I can sprint with this so that really helps out because you can't sprint with money bags and you're super slow with gold bags so I mean uh, having jewelry bags is really good. I'm, I think I've only had jewelry bags like one other time to spawn, which is great. And be uh, be mindful that the cops ca the cops can pick up your bags of of, uh, of loot that you have on the ground. So just uh, watch out for that. 
Because I mean, you may turn around and they may, they all be they all may be gone. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to pick him up. I'm just uh, when I when I got garage escape and I and I escaped with eight bags. I escaped with like ten seconds left. But be mindful that uh, when you do get garage escape on this, because it's crime that offline, you can restart. You can go into the start menu like that and restart the game, and you will restart from the garage escape. So if you don't have a good run and you mess up, you can restart from the garage and you're and you're fine. So there's no problems there. So just uh, so just keep that in mind whenever you guys do it. So that does help you out a lot more if you're doing uh, crime that offline. So I think how many do I have? One, two, three, four, five. I think I have seven. Get one more. So whenever I do this, um, okay, there's the van. Go ahead and, uh, and just toss it. I just go in through. Gosh, okay, I gotta take some of these guys out. Just give me some, uh, give me some room to do this. If I wanted to, I could just run each one, but you know that's not the, that's not the most effective way to do this. And if you guys want to skip to the end and just see if I get the garage escape or not, you can do that. And I'd recommend you guys uh, trying this game out if you're watching this video. Give it a shot. Whatever it, uh, it's like 30 something bucks on uh, PS4, PSN store right now for the remastered version. It's a lot of fun. It's a lot of fun to play with friends. And it's something uh, that I've, been, I've really never played before, which is which is great that I. It's four. Make sure I have four bags. Yep. Okay. I mean the AI and uh, the AI in this is pretty pretty garbage. So whenever you do this, yeah, you're gonna want to play with friends because. Yeah. But you can do this solo. It's possible to escape with eight bags, especially when you have jewelry. Because uh, I mean, excuse me, sprint with it. If I had money bags, I'd just be walking right now. And tons of other stuff with uh, will t uh, tons of other sources will tell you escape. Oh shoot! Oh shoot! Oh shoot! They'll say escape, uh, es escape with ten minutes or escape over ten minutes. Blah blah blah. I didn't. I don't think I did that. I didn't mark down my time. I see he's escaping with my bag. Come back here. So yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, throw all these bags in here. And then maybe I'll get uh, Garage Escape. We'll see. I mean, if I don't, it's no big deal. You guys know how to do it now. So just run this. It only it, it, it didn't take me that long. It really it won't take you guys that long either. Just go ahead and toss all the bags in. So many, yeah, the AI is trash. They'll try to take out the snipers and stuff, but yeah, it pretty much won't happen. Eight. Let me check. Uh, two, four, six. All right, I have eight bags. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, go ahead and escape. See what we get. See if we get, if we get garage escape. It's gonna be. I got an escape. Oh my gosh! If this is garage escape, I'm gonna freak. <laughs> oh my gosh! All right. So let's go and proceed to the next day. If this is really, gr I mean, that 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 right there exactly. I got an escape. And it's only overpass or garage. That's the only two it can be. So whenever you're doing this and you're like, oh man, it's a 50-50 yeah. shot pretty much. I don't think it can be anyone else. If it's garage escape, it's going to be crazy. Because all of you guys know that whenever you garage escape, oh my gosh. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, it's crazy because I am doing this live. Just so you got this. This game isn't pre-recorded. You guys probably know that. I mean, now okay. I'm, uh, I'll just do this a little bit. Uh, I use like the ballistic vest. Uh, I can. How, how fast am I with that? I'll do it just straight up two-piece suit. You can run whatever you want, whatever guns, whatever you want to feel comfortable with it. That's crazy. That's crazy. I mean, you guys know what to do now. Um, I'll show you the level that you throw the bags up to. Uh, so you're going to grab it. 
Now they're gonna, the cops are gonna try to start grabbing the bags immediately pretty much. I'm just gonna try to throw it up to the ledge. You wanna throw it up to the uh, top, top layer up here? This is where throwing the bags farther comes in. Crap, yeah, they're gonna start grabbing. This is where throwing bags further comes into play because you have like, you have like five something minutes. Oh, six, okay. You have six minutes. Oh, don't grab the bags, please. Oh my gosh, so annoying. Alright, I think that's it. So just, I mean, if you want to throw them all up there and just sprint, follow the path I'm going, you'll get up there really quick and just take out the cops and you just take control of your bags again. This game is a little laggy just because it's PS3. Hope they fix that a little bit on the new one. Actually, they're moving it towards my destination, so it's good. So, uh, I mean, you can... I don't go that. I don't go that way straight. I go this way. You throw them all over here. Um... I mean, yeah, just because this is... You can do it with money bags. You have to be really quick. Like, you have to know what you're doing. You have to know your stuff to do this. But, yeah, it's 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 not tough. It's not tough at all. I mean, <laughs> it was tough when I, did the, when I did the money bags because I escaped with 10 seconds left. But just, uh, I mean, like I said... I may give you guys an example and just go and pause the game and uh, and restart just to show you guys that you can do the garage escape again. I'm not. I'm probably not going to keep going more. I mean, uh, you're just going to move all the bags. I can move those two over here. Get them all right here. Um, you can lock lock pick that door to get through it. If I had the saw, I could saw through it, but that doesn't really matter. I mean, you can go up here. I'm pretty sure this is in the direct open fire though. Yeah, like this is this is actually. If you guys wanted to to move the bags um, and toss them across this, it's kind of a it's kind of a risky shot. Now I wouldn't recommend that. Never mind. But uh, I mean, if you want to do that, because you'd have to it, to to deliver them, you'd have to run all the way around, and they vanish right there. And I mean, to get to the bags, all you have to do is go through this door, go down the stairs, and there's another door. So, for example, if you guys screwed up, if you screwed up, and you're like, "Oh man, my time's terrible." Go ahead and press start, restart game, and it will it will bring you back right to the garage escape again. And you can give it another shot, and you're good to go. So I'll uh, I'll just go ahead and let that let that pop up on the screen for you guys, and then I'm gonna end the video. I can't believe that I got garage escape though. That's ridiculous. However many times I tried rats, and rats is awful because it takes. Um, it takes like 30 minutes for the first part. Yeah, so there you go. It spawns in Garage Escape. You can just go and do it again. So uh, I hope I helped you guys out. Just try this. Just just do it like um, five times, five tries at a time. Do it five times. Take a break. That's only an, it's only about 50 minutes, 45 minutes out of your out of your time. So just give it a give it like five tries and stop. Five more tries. Do it exactly how I did it. Make sure you kill civilians. Get this, uh, get the drill on. Get the bags. Get out. You're gonna be set. Just give it a shot. Let me know uh, if it help, if it worked for you guys, or if, or if you did a different strategy and it worked for you in that way. Let me know. I'd be really excited to see, see what happened with you guys. And uh, if there's anything else you guys would like to see, any other trophies, I can definitely do that because I have platinum this game, so I know everything about it. And uh, go ahead and give this video a like. That would help me out so much. I mean, I ran it again and got Garage Escape. I can't believe that still. Um, and subscribe for more if you guys like this. It helped you out. Just leave subscribe. That helps me out so much. And it lets me know that you guys are enjoying what I'm doing to help you guys out. All right? Thank you, guys. Take it easy.